Please don't whistle while we're doing this. Is there anyone dealing? Not no. yet. I'm glad I still have viewport control. Just follow the link I put in your video. Live stream. Filters. What are you looking for? Features live. Nothing in Open Rails live stream. What's it called? Open Rails Empire Builder. Okay. It says I'm live. Please stand by. Have you YouTube. started it yet? Yeah. YouTube might want to wait for the 7 o'clock, though. Well, I have a gray screen. It's not the best of options. Obviously. There's still nothing. It's just a white screen. Really? Yeah. Just a second. Why won't it do direct from screen? Try it again. You mean like that? to that. You will need the full screen. I can't. You can expand your window, though. 
to cover most of full screen. Do you want to see why I can't? There, just leave it like that. It's behind by about a minute and a half, but a minute and a half. You just drag one display over the other. It's been less than a minute since Hunter sent that. to go then? Can you expand that out a little bit at all? Nope. It doesn't give the option to. <laughs> and what happens if you hit full screen on that? It won't. Why? Because Open Rails is not the smartest in that regard. Um, just a second. So, hey, I guess we're live. And yeah. just a second. I'm doing screen resolution. I just want to know. Can you not do it on that screen? Apparently not. I'm going to restart um, with a bigger... visualization. Well, okay. right now it just showed me moving. Remember whenever I moved over the thing and said, why can't you maximize? Well, how's that for good size screen? Perfect. Covers everything. Yeah, it Yay. does. Uh, let me just go ahead and drag it up a little bit so that Open Rails itself is not visible or not. At 9 a.m., so we're only about an hour late. <laughs> We're only an hour late. <laughs> this is the HUD I'm going to leave up. I'm glad we got it working. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I know. Here, let's... Just a second. All right. So we got this live stream rolling. And the train. And the rolling. train, yeah. <laughs> we got the train moving. Let's try to spot the sightseer in front of the... Uh, in front of the station. Sounds good to me.
It may take a while. That's all the further we are. That's all right. Yep, not too bad. All right, our first live stream. Gotta love the power of the internet. Yep. We're crawling along at five miles an hour. Sure beats being stopped. <laughs> like Amtrak is most of the time in real life. <laughs> Not really. I keep it moving at about 30 <laughs> when it's scheduled for 80. <laughs> <laughs> they keep it moving about 30, five hours behind where when it should be. <laughs> oh, they move just, you know, offset from what they're supposed to. Okay. Ooh. Oh, that truck is that truck is not gonna have a good time with that. <laughs> According to YouTube, we wanna get the frame rate up to thirty. Oh well. Yeah, it's really laggy, so Well we can't really raise the Unless I close some windows. Like that one. And I didn't like that. <laughs> now it's I like do know one this. thing that you could do. What? You could adjust your allocated RAM. Actually, no, I can't. Why? Do you already have it maxed out? I know my laptop is maxed out. I don't know. This live stream might turn into semi a podcast. We could start our pod start a podcast. If you want to. Half hour streams every week. Half hour? Yeah. Just a half hour for a podcast. I mean, what are we gonna talk about? Well now we gotta stop. Eh, at least we're getting some of the bugs worked out. Yeah. With only one viewer. And that's me. Okay, that's good enough. Hey, I'll be right back, Code. I'm going to make a couple calls. Okay. How long of a stop should I make? Immediate. How long should I be stopped? Uh, five minutes. Okay.
Just so everyone knows, we're not planning on following speed limits. I'll be in in about a minute, so let's go ahead and get the trainer rolling. It is. <laughs> okay, so you're actually going to hear me Go next up, Bus Glacier. Yeah, I know. I said in a minute it would. It's been about a minute, so. Party is back. Three what? Three playbacks so far. Well, one of them's Justice. Yeah, I know. I, that's the one that's currently in parallel with yours. But someone jumped on right there. Yeah. For a couple seconds. Hey, it beats nothing. Yeah. I did uh, let them know that we're not going to be following speed limits at all. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And my next intended stop is West Glacier. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and post my... Well, not yet. I think I'm going to get a Twitter roll in here. And then we'll post a link to that in the comments. And anyone who wants to... Send a suggestion if you want to go somewhere else. Send us a suggestion on Twitter. And we are, in fact, uh, going to be ready to go on a different route uh, with a different train for the ha second half of today's stream. Sounds awesome. The only unfortunate part is when the audio encoding is happening, it lags the game. <laughs> oh, that sucks balls. If you have any comments, go ahead and put them up on this video. Um, I'm watching them, so... If you have any suggestions, post them there until I get the Twitter up. Looks like we've got a grain train that we're about to meet. Let's see if we can get a good view on that.
There we go. BNSF. Yeah, that's the first of about a dozen trains that we get to meet in this scenario. I truly sure like your feedback on whether or not you want to hear the history of the area that we're going through or stuff like that. Pretty but much any suggestions you have. Yep. And justice, that means you, because you're the only one watching right now. Ninety-three and a seventy. That'd be quite a ticket. Yeah, <laughs> it would. Especially with a 45 coming up. Let's see if YouTube is complaining about this. Yes, it is. Are we lagging out? That's part of it. Yeah, not too bad, but the playback uh, resolution isn't the greatest. Well, you're listed as a 480. What about anyone else? Everyone's listed as 480 for now. Yeah. Even with 12 gigs of RAM. Yeah, I don't think it's on my end. I think it's the MSU network. Yeah, it probably is the crappy Montana internet we're on. Sorry about that. Yeah, we really need to get that in the other window. Well, I can't. The notification always is going to pop up there instead. Oh well. I really don't have too much going on in Google Hangouts, so... And they should be pretty quiet. They're heading to go get some food. Yep. But maybe they'll jump on in a bit. Let's hope. Yeah, let's hope. And 103 miles an hour. And 45. That wouldn't be a ticket. That'd be jail time. Yeah. Let's see here. At OG what not to do in. Original what not to do in. Create my account. Well, we're about to head through a tunnel, so I think I'm going to jump into the sightseer lounge car. Sweet. Especially since this canyon has an actual river going through it. Take a look. Nice. Beautiful view. Yeah, and if you want to see a certain view, just let us know. And, 
again, if there's anything else you want, just comment on it. And feel free to introduce yourself. are now ready to roll uh, Twitter so Cody will put that in the comments uh, if you just want an idea if you want to tweet at us it's at OG what not to do in and Cody will put that in the comments you introduce yourself. and let's hope we can get no feedback all right I can't comment on it right here. I think I can. Oh, wait, right here. There we go. Got it? Yeah. Shield. It's at... I got it. O-G what not to do in. Alright, so feel free to tweet at us. Give us a little tweeter. Make my tweeter giggle. So, I don't know what it is, Cody, but the parking here on campus sucks. Utterly blows. Like, seriously, MSU needs to get its shit together. Oh, that wasn't. A part of the, um, oh, what was it? Yeah, the Exponent had an article uh, for this week about the expansion of the campus, and that was part of it. So we'll see if anything comes of it. They say that when they put up the new engineering building, they're putting in a new parking lot to replace the class they're taking up, plus a few more. <laughs> yeah, well, they better get on it. They seriously need to do something about this. It's BS. This is the little town of Corum. It's got a 11,000 foot siding that we're going into. And one house. Uh, quite a few houses, but... <laughs> oh. Hey, Justice, did you drop out or something? Finally, on Twitter. All right, let's see here. What's the link on YouTube for the vid? Um, here. Just go to the video and there's a share on Twitter. Well, I'm just going to copy it down. Let's see here. Okay, part of the share is a link. So. Or I can just go to the video and copy the link from the URL. Well, the link on the video, had, uh, that URL would take them to it, but it's more of an analytics thing that goes through the other one. Yeah. Most of them have already got the tweet ready. Okay. So. Open rails. Empire Builder. Five right now. Control C. All right. 
Alright, we are now tweeted. So again, hit us up on Twitter, follow us, like us. <laughs> subscribe. Subscribe on YouTube. We'll, we'll be here. We'll keep making some more videos, and hopefully we'll have a live stream once every week or two, at least. Uh, might not always be in open rails, depends on what we can get rolling. We also have open TTV and a couple others that we can try. Um, Heck, if I can get it to work on my laptop, I can do a Minecraft live stream. <laughs> now that would be fun. Oh yeah. Now I get rolling the way I want to. It costs 120 bucks for a capture card, but if we can get it, hook it up to my Xbox and do some real FPS live streaming. Well, we got to start slowing down for West Glacier Depot, in part. There's also a meet scheduled for West Glacier, so either way, we got to stop. <laughs> Anything on Twitter? Yeah, I got a talk. I think it's justice. What's he got to say? Can't post in chat. Oh. Alright. If you can't post in chat, I don't know. I mean, you could try just going straight commenting. Um, I don't know what you want to do. But, um, well, I want to stop. You should be able to direct comment at least to the video. I want to stop before I hit that red. <sighs> what do you guys think? Should we be, um, trying to make all the passenger stops, or should we just keep on going through the stations? Yeah, again, hit us up. This really is just a time for people to tell us what they want. We'll and try to get it in. Justice wants us to wreck a train for him. Sorry, this sim doesn't have wrecks in it. We could uh, try, we could go a thousand miles an hour, but we still wouldn't wreck. How about this? At the end of the video, we'll smash into the end of the track and we'll show you what happens. Alright, I need to plug my laptop in. If you really want to watch a train wreck, I've got another video on my channel that has a miniature train wrecking. Cute little video, I'll tell you that. And this is West Glacier. We'll be holding here until we meet one train. Alright, let's see here. I really do wish that they had more time options on the streamline for getting to Belgrade and back. Oh, yeah. I mean, literally, if I want to make it to my class at 10 o'clock in the morning, I have to get on the bus at a quarter to 7. Which is a little inconvenient because I like my sleep. There's a reason I did not select 8 o'clock classes. I got smarter than that. But, yeah, if only, if only, right? Yep. Make sure to keep an eye on the Twitter feed. So am I. <laughs> hmm. We have one photo slash video. This is the video. Oh. Embedded. Yep. Sweet. 
And right now we've got three people watching. I think I'm going to fast forward time while we're in the station. Yeah, that might not be a bad idea. I thought it was 330% sound. Yeah, that'll work. At least for now. Yeah, you get to watch all the little cars scurry around. <laughs> like lemmings. Trying to figure out Someone. which one to follow. <laughs> figure, trying to figure out which one to follow off the cliff. Yeah, there's really no cliffs in the area. Accessible by car, at least. <laughs> no, but you can climb up in Glacier. Uh, believe me, you can definitely do that. We're going to accelerate time while we're in station stops waiting for meets and such, but uh, normal will not be doing that. Whoa, that truck is going to make a speedy delivery. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Hey, we got a green. And for everyone watching the live stream, uh... Let us know how the play uh, how the playback is, whether it's laggy as crap. We gotta try to work out some of those bugs. And there's the stack train that we were told to meet. Oof. This one I believe is seventy cars long. International intermodal. Yep. The only type in the game. <laughs> <laughs> Three up front and none on the back. Funny, they're numbered like dash nines, but they look like aces. <laughs> <laughs> they're dash nines. It's just a quirk of the game. What? That they look like aces. <laughs> well, they have the exact design of the ace. Here but they have go. the exact numbering of a We're dash full nine. throttle, and we're going to ride in the cab for this portion because there's a lot of tunnels. Yeah, and Open Rails does not like it when you are not in cab view going through tunnels. No, it doesn't. <laughs> How would you like to be inside the mountain? <laughs> and then it gives you the Minecraft. Do, 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 click. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys really like this view, we can keep on doing it. It's... Uh, cab view without the control stand. I know it's one of my fave views. I don't know, but I also like over the, oh, the overhead view. You get to see what the train really looks like. Yeah, you mean like the one that we've been riding in since uh, about Quorum? Yeah. <laughs> yep, that would be the one. Here I was thinking we'd need filler material. <laughs> Filler material. I prefer uh, apple pie filling as my <laughs> material. Mostly because I prefer apple pie. So, what do you think about the uh, rewrite on this route? This is the fifth generation for this route. It's definitely a lot better. I mean, it's a lot more graphically good. Yeah. I the think trees don't look like turd, they don't look like Atta Krev. Yeah. I think that if... Um, There's an error right there on the side of the tunnel. Yeah, that's part of the program, but what can you do? Hey, it's a free program. Yep. <laughs> what are you going to do? There's a hole in the tunnel. There's a lot of holes in these tunnels. <laughs> hey, if you guys want, we can run a high-speed train for the next one, as in uh, French TGV in France. I don't know. Sounds good to me. At least it runs a little bit quicker. <laughs> yeah, 200 miles an hour. Oh, what upset could. Yeah. Go in the live stream.
Hope you guys enjoy the train ride. Um, we're just kind of rolling through the mountains right now, and we will be for about another 80 miles or so. Then we'll be running along at 103 miles an hour for about 50 miles. Should be fun. <laughs> I'm thinking that we're going to be making stops for picking up passengers at East Glacier and Cutbank and Shelby, and that's it. Those are the remaining stops, unless we hit a red signal. I will obey signals because if I don't, we go into emergency. And an emergency application is not easy to recover from. You could say that we would be screwed if we uh, decided to go into emergency. Although at some point we may drop up uh, the back of our train off and just run with just the Seattle section of the Empire Builder instead of the Portland and Seattle's combined. But I'll leave that part up to you guys. Which would you prefer? Leave four cars behind or keep them on. We're going to jump out of the cab now and go ahead and ride along on the tail end. We're done with tunnels for now, so... Well, I apologize for that slight pause in my being here. So, where are we at right now? Well, we are currently in Red Eagle. Huh. With two people watching. Including me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And I am actually going to be um, posting a link on <laughs> on a uh, forum here pretty soon to get see if we can get more people. Sounds good to me. The sure as hell ain't no Rooster Teeth podcast. <laughs> 200,000 viewers during live stream. <laughs> yeah, that'd be kind of hard to do. That's exactly 100,000 times more than we have. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. We can't have songs on YouTube like that. Here. 
right there. Uh, looks like we're probably going to be coming up to a um, red at the end of this double track section. Hmm. Oh, jeez. Trying to think of something good to talk about. Yeah. You don't do the Dougie? No, not in Kentucky. You still love me. Well, we're... I'm just waiting for a skateboarder to ride by and just eat shit into the pavement. <laughs> <laughs> that would be funny. <laughs> yeah, it's just like... do to do Ah! Boosh! My face! We're just going to coast up to the signal. It's still more than three miles out, so... Well, we have time at least. Yeah. Alright, I'm going to see where we're at here. Need my headphones. <laughs> what? Uh, okay. I've got a couple of more tags to put on. Hashtag Hoa. That wasn't me. All right. Let's see here. Checking the tweets. Checking the tweets. Hmm. Well, we better start me applying the brakes because we're about two miles out. Hey, we're actually below the speed limit. So, anyone wants to get in on this, you know, just uh, hit us up with the tweet uh, with hashtag open rails WNTDI, all lowercase. I wasn't aware that hashtags were case sensitive. They are. Yeah. Okay. Learn something new every day. Yep. Smarter every day. <laughs> so like we're telling you guys, once we're done with this run, we'll ah, take a short break while we're loading up another run. Alright, let's get in on Open Rails WNTDI. So far, nothing.
Uh, it's time to set the brakes. Alright. www.twitter.com My tweeter. My tweeter feeder. I'm going to feed my tweeter. I'm going to stuff it. I'm going to stuff that tweeter of mine. And now we sit and wait. Shouldn't take too long at this one, so I'm not going to accelerate it. Let's see if I can do it just in Dang. What? That's different between Facebook and Twitter. In Facebook, I can be logged into two different accounts at once on my computer. All right, let's see here. That's where oh, what a beautiful sunset. <laughs> Don't you wish you could have that in the live stream? Oh yeah. I'll hold this up. We can. <laughs> nah. It wouldn't take very long. No, but if we do, I'd like to corner window it. Darn. Yeah. Oh well. Maybe next time. Briefly had four visit, four viewers. Yeah, we did. Still do. Welcome everyone. Well, we're currently waiting here for a freight train to meet us. Uh, I'm sure of the type right now. Um, maybe we should accelerate time a little bit. Maybe. Don't you wish you could do that in real life? Yeah, really. <laughs> Just make it go faster. Okay, we're at 338% of normal time. Search Twitter. At, uh, check the Twitter feed for hashtag... Uh, Openers. Oh, you're Someone so loves it. <laughs> hey, man. Calling you number Ooh, one right there now. There we go. Number, number one. There's our meat. High speed auto rack. Yeah. Too fast. 338% <laughs> of normal. Well, once it clears that switch, we'll get a green. So I'm going to start prepping for that. Friday night, Rooster Teeth sponsor cut. Is it Thursday night or Friday night that's Ruby? Can't remember. Well, we're on the roll, hoping that we don't get to the signal before the end of their train. <laughs> for an at Streamy's Audience Choice Award. Streamies, huh? Yeah, I saw that going on on a different site. Um, I don't know it, what it's all about, but I doubt that we'll get one. We have one new tweet. <laughs> Retweeted by Bernie Burns. At OG. Got to make sure that our wheels don't slip or we're not going to make it up this Follow. little bit of a hill. All right. Sweet.
For those of you just joining us, we're going to be making stops in East Glacier, uh, Cutbank, and Shelby um, to pick up passengers. No one actually moves in this game, but uh, we actually, it just makes a bit of fun. <laughs> Yay me on Twitter. I have a whopping eight followers and three favorites. And here we go, full throttle. There are a couple of tunnels, so that we're, so we're going to go ahead and go into the sites here, lounge car. Yeah, this is fun. Just sitting here watching the train ahead of us curving around the bends. Yeah. Having a nice seat launch like out the window. In part because we're right next to a cliff. <laughs> tree. Tunnel. Watch out for that tree. Hello, tunnel. <laughs> Goodbye, head. <laughs> Let's see if we can spot the bridge. Ah, there it is. <laughs> I hear that train a coming. It's coming around the bend. <laughs> I ain't seen the sunshine since I don't know when. Alright. So if anyone has any suggestions, go ahead and comment on uh, the video or put it up on Twitter or anything. Uh, we're open for suggestions. And... Hey, this is all for you guys, so you tell us what you want us to do on here. Within reason, of course. Yes. Crashing trains, not exactly a possibility in this game. Yeah, unfortunately, the uh, way that it's coded, it doesn't have crashes enabled. Um, but at the end of the video, we are going to demonstrate what happens when we get to the end of track in Shelby. We're going to stop at the station and then accelerate full throttle. Yeah, I think we do got to work on something with this. Yeah. Because the playback on the computer is beautiful. But on YouTube, not so much. Yeah. I mean, it's still a pretty cool ride, though. I wonder if maybe we should uh, set it up so that we record it and then we post it later. Yeah. A pre-recorded live stream <laughs> doesn't exactly work, but... Well, we can work something out. Like I yeah. said, nothing else. You can allocate more RAM. Well, the RAM's not going to help with the bandwidth issue. True. Which Very is true. what YouTube is screaming at me about. <laughs> Can't exactly fix Montana State University Internet. Nope. And since it's on the desktop, can't really move it either. That's true. <laughs> Quite true. Although if this does get uh, popular enough, we can uh, see about moving to a different location to do a higher speed uh, upload. Yeah, next year. <laughs> <laughs> Somewhere where they don't throttle the internet to each user. Yeah, really. But... Uh... Well, hold on, I'll be right back. Okay. It looks like we're coming up on another red, so... Okay. Should I stop in the village of Essex just so that we can wait there where it's more... I love the nice village of Essex. How far are we out of Chester at this point? Mm, 200 plus miles. My summer home. 
<laughs> and the tracks don't go there in the game. Aren't we on the GN High Line? Nope. This is uh, MPV5. Mariah's Pass. Version 5. Yeah. Which doesn't include the... Uh, well, how far east does line. it go? Shelby. Seriously, 40 miles from Chester is all the further it goes. Next time we're going to Chester. I guess next time we're on uh, GN Highline, maybe I'll f see if I can download the correct type of trains for it so we don't have modern trains on 50s Aero track. Well, what's the next version for GN Highline? Is it more modern? GN Highline only has one. <laughs> when are they going to make another one? They aren't. We should make it. Good luck. <laughs> Give me five years and I will. <laughs> Right back. Okay. We're going to be holding here in Essex for just a few minutes. Uh, it's just around the corner, and it's in front of the famous Isaac Walton Inn. If any of you have ever been there, you know why I say famous. And for those of you that haven't been there and want to visit Montana, this is the place to be. It's uh, right uh, in the forest and right next to a rail yard, but the rail yard doesn't really have any traffic in and out. It's got a good system of uh, cross-country ski trails and bike trails, and it's got it's a stop on the Red Bus uh, tour for Glacier National Park right on the southern border of the park. Uh, it's right in between two very um, large sections of publicly owned land. So that uh, means that it will be in this... Uh, it will look like this forever. The only thing that might change is BNSF at some point might remove the yard. We've got to try to stop it so that we have a good view of the station, well, of the hotel itself. Right in here. If you guys have any questions, please feel free to ask via Twitter or Facebook. Well, not Facebook, but on Twitter or the comments on YouTube. Really doesn't matter. Um, we try to accommodate your requests at all costs uh, to a point. Uh, if it's not possible within the program that we're in, it's not going to happen, and we will explain that to you. Um, but we'll attempt to try to get every suggestion we have in, in some way, shape, or form. The reason I decided to stop down here instead of up at the top of the pass, well, at, a, at the end of the siding where that red signal is, is because it's on a hill, so I want a good run at the hill before we start going up it. It's the main part of Marias Pass. It's a 2% grade, um, which for a train that is torture. You don't want to stop on a 2% grade at all. Uh, you guys kind of saw that back at the previous place where we stopped, and I was an idiot and decided to stop right on the steepest part of the grade. I'll own up on that one. I was an idiot. Anyway, time to accelerate time.
on a 300% time zone. Holding at Essex. For those of us, well, for those of us that know this hotel, um, the bridge over the tracks that you see on in front of our locomotives, that is a very good photo location. And I have another video of an Amtrak train going under that bridge. And that one's live action, and the train is backwards. <laughs> it's running with a freight locomotive leading two passenger engines. And the baggage car is at the back instead of at the front on this train. This is the standard consist for this train, but uh, in that case, it had to be turned in route, and the place they turned it at didn't have a way of turning the train around itself, so they just ran around it. Uh, there had been a derailment in the Williston, North Dakota area, so they had to turn the train around there instead of at Chicago, where they normally do. So, yeah. <laughs> there were a lot of people there taking photos and videos of that particular train. And a couple hours, um, a few hours later, at about 5 in the morning, so about 12 hours later, I was up and I saw the one that was supposed to be there at that time go by. It was 12 hours late, and the other one was 24 hours late. Right now, I'm just watching for my signal to turn green ahead of me. Um, as long as I'm sitting here, we're just ready to take suggestions whenever you guys have them. And we're about to lose one viewer. Go back down. Did we? Yeah. Okay. Not yet. But we've been sitting in what on uh, Essex for the whole time. You know? Yeah, she told me the train was stopped. Yeah, I'm at 3x speed right now. Hey, at least we're getting some traffic, though. Yeah. I told them the story of that 24-hour uh, late train that I <laughs> caught on that bridge. <laughs> I videotaped it from that bridge. Hey, we're oh, getting late. Here we go. Hey, we can get rolling again. Woo. Brakes are released. Here we go. Sweet. Wheel slip. Ever so slight. Hey, it's going to happen. Yep. There's nothing we can do about it. Throw some sand down. <laughs> I'm good. Just for effect. Right now I'm in notch three. And the wheel slip is only every once in a while. Sand may be a good idea. Do we want to take bets on what type of train we're going to meet? Oh, I'll take a piece of that action. How much are we betting? $20? $100? <laughs> um, how about just the gentleman's bets where we don't ah, put up any cash at all? Fun. 
in part because I already know. Well, that's no fun. <laughs> Probably going to be another intermodal train. Nope. What, coal train? Nope. Oil train? Yep. So it's an oil train. Yeah, I don't have coal available in this, so... That's another thing I can download. I can download different types of cars for the next time we do this. Yeah, if you guys want to want to see a different kind of train, and maybe, you know, see a different road or something, just uh, let us know. I'll try to find it or a very good as, uh, approximation. And, uh, yeah, let us know on Twitter. Uh, let us know in the YouTube comments. But uh, we can make that happen for you. And we can also see um, about maybe doing one a week of this type of thing. Maybe different games, but... I don't know, sounds like fun to me. Yeah. Look at that, it was an oil train. <laughs> whoop de freaking do Ah, r bloody Randy. <laughs> you better hope that none of those tank cars go boom as you roll by. <laughs> yeah, that would, uh, that would certainly ruin your day. Oh, yeah. You know it, Mike. That would not be fun. No. <laughs> I believe that we'd be losing a few customers on that Amtrak train. Yeah, you'd be losing a few to death. <laughs> <laughs> we'd be losing a few lives there, Mike. We'd be having some mate on the barbie. I'm glad to see someone was able to connect at 720p. Yeah, sure beats uh, 360. Or the 480 that you've been on all the time? Yeah, I've been on 480 the whole bloody time. What? That happens. Yep. You win some, you lose some. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Let's see here. What we got with the hashtag open rails WNTDI sweet one tweet come on people jump on it we want to know what you guys want what you want, for God's sakes. I can't keep this accent forever. So please, tell us that you want Randy to go back to his normal voice. <laughs> I don't know, it's just... bloody fun. <laughs> if you look real close whenever we go by a mainline crossover or a mainline switch, uh, they all have track heaters on this particular route. Well, that's pretty blimey interesting. Yeah, I'll try to point them out the next time we get close to one. Which will be at Summit. <laughs> Sounds good, Mike. I don't know, I, I might even sound a bit better with my accent. Well, that's a matter of opinion, but I'd say no. I know, we just got another viewer. <laughs> so, maybe it's just what the people want. That may be, but... You know they like a good Australian accent. They know, you know they like a good Aussie. <laughs> some blokes and some chillers. Now, the nice thing about this game is that anyone with it and the route that we are running on, uh, if I set it up correctly, we can put out the IP address and we can have a multiplayer game. 
Yeah, that would uh, that would be fun. Of course, there would be no rules other than obey the signals. Hold on a sec, there, Mike. Something wrong? No, nothing right now. Right now the plan is to uh, go from, well, once we get to Shelby and end of the track, uh, we'll either uh, choose to run back on the same route with a freight train, or maybe we'll try the Great Northern High Line with the freight train. Go through Chester. Somewhere, when we're getting feedback. You're in a feedback loop? Something like that. Well, it looks like we're plateaued at 52 miles an hour. Still almost twice the speed limit, but... Yeah, it's a uh, short beats walking. Yeah. Or pushing. Yeah. <laughs> that, uh, that's, that is true. <laughs> that would be a good test of a person. Yeah, I want you to push this train up a hill. And not die in the process. <laughs> Still getting the feedback? No, nope. something's something's changed. So <laughs> sounds good now, but I'm buffering now. Ooh, so it's not good. Yeah, it might be this blimey internet connection that we have. Yeah, Apologise to our viewers. So uh, might help, might change, might not. But uh, probably won't. We'll uh, do what we can here. So, yeah, this is a production of what not to do in, and is that current right now? Uh, as current as it can be, down to one. Yeah, so we must have just lost it. And we're back. But uh, make sure we're still live here. Boy, we're... I'm two minutes behind now. I'm lagging. Well, I might pause the recording just to give us a, um, a little bit of time to do a little testing. Yeah. We're back to two people. Yeah, I'm going to make a post here in the comments. Well, you're not the only one that was able to do that. I'm just going to tell them we're going to have to cut it short. Like how long? Like, stop now.
be able to make it up to the top of the hill before cutting. That's what it looks like. Yeah, no. But we'll be back again soon for another live stream for pre-recorded video. Someone is still watching, so... Yeah, we won't. We're gonna have to cut this one short. But hey, it was nice to get some views. Thanks to for thanks to everyone for watching. And uh, well, if we can't get uh, live stream working, we'll play around with it this week. But uh, we'll be back again next week uh, with nothing else. We'll just have a pre-recorded show. We'll do the same thing, but won't be able to give us any suggestions. Uh, well, Although you can suggest a route while we're uh, away. Yeah, if you guys want to see something next week. and uh, Pretty much anywhere in North America or Asia or Europe. So anywhere, basically, that matters. <laughs> so, but thanks for watching, everyone, and... Uh, Have a good I, night. Yep, and we'll see you next week. Bye.